Spring breakers on South Beach will have to cut their partying short after a ruling by a judge. An ordinance has now been set to roll back liquor sales to 2 in the morning. And Local 10's Leanne Morahone is joining us live. She is on Miami Beach right now to explain. I suspect this is going to be unpopular with those spring breakers. Yeah, likely. And those that like to come to Story, places like Story, uh, every weekend or maybe some days on weeknights, right? Yeah, I don't know your life. Anyway, Story is open until 5 a.m. That liquor license is also uh, until 5 a.m. So you could get a drink here until 5. But this ordinance is not only being allowed to move forward, uh, but we just learned that as of this morning, there's a stay. So the businesses here have 30 days not only to uh, get used to that 2 a.m. cutoff, but also uh, file any appeals if they'd like to. A big win for the city of Miami Beach. A judge ruling Tuesday that an ordinance passed by the city last month can move forward, prohibiting the sale of alcohol in most businesses in the South of 5th District after 2 a.m. This South of 5th is a residential neighborhood. Uh, there are over 5,000 residents, close to 1,000 children. There's an elementary school, there are houses of worship. It's not a neighborhood that should have all night clubs. Uh, and I don't think our residents should have to endure that. Lawyers representing Story Nightclub, a large and popular club here on the beach, took the city to court, requesting an injunction that would have blocked the ordinance from taking effect, at least temporarily. But the judge denied it. In a statement, their lawyer said, quote, Story is more than a nightclub. It is a nearly 30-year staple of our community and part of what gives South Beach its reputation for safe and enjoyable hospitality experiences. Hundreds of people depend on Story for their livelihoods, and we could not be more grateful that they have the opportunity to stay in business as we begin the appeals process. We're confident that Story will prevail. I don't know. It's been here for 30 years. People seem to love it. Leah Holdari lives south of 5th and says she's conflicted over what the cutoff will mean for the area. You know, I don't know, I'm all for people having fun, but if it's keeping people awake at night, it's a little tough. So again, there is a 30 day stay, which means that the city has told us they will not be enforcing uh, this 2 a.m. cutoff in this particular area for at least that long. Uh, the Miami Beach mayor telling us that they're considering even appealing that so that they can begin to enforce it sooner. And of course, lawyers for Story Nightclub say that they will appeal that judge's decision. For now, reporting live here on South Beach, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News. All right, Leanne, thank you for that.